Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the wilderness of product development. So like we saw before, we can uh, take a look and navigate enormous sets of data that are fully detailed in product view, and this is product view 9.0. But now one of the other things that we can use product view for very effectively is as a tool for communicating with our suppliers and vendors, and that's actually what I'm gonna be doing here. So the first thing I might wanna take a look at is I can see that I do have the full product structure here, but let's take a look inside the loader and specifically see where I wanna have the folks that engage working to design that monitor assembly. So here I just sectioned in and I can see in front of the steering column, the design is looking pretty much complete, except for the fact that this monitor assembly is missing. And so typically this would be something pretty uh, difficult to do on an outsourced basis because we are so close to the end of the project. But we're gonna try and treat Engage as one of our extended in-house design teams using the collaboration capabilities. And then the final thing we can do is take a look at the multi-view option, which is really an ideal tool if we wanna do some web conferencing and do a design review with Engage and let them know they've won the bid. This might be one of the tools that we would employ where we can look at lots of different information and different pieces very quickly to communicate effectively so the guys can get a head start. So here's my design at a later stage. Now, I have some updated information from our electrical guys, so I wanna make sure I input that directly into the model here. And I can do that quite easily. I'll just import this file. And you see I've updated the model with all the electrical components. Finally, my mechanical design now is in sync with the electrical design. And so in addition to just kind of placing them into the assembly so I can see exactly what this kind of looks like, we can also start performing some ergonomic studies now. I could do, for instance, some vision cones. I could do some reach envelopes. Or specifically what I'm interested in is I want to see how this operator is going to interact with the controls in the assembly. So the first thing I want to do is I'm just going to go ahead and set up a few postures. And so postures are basically ways that I can specify how's this operator actually going to reach for the controls, how's it going to look when he's actually operating with this machine. So I just grabbed one of the postures, and I can see this is what it looks like, and everything seems to be within reach, pretty comfortable for him to operate and use. Engage has thrived in the product development wilderness. They were able to create a new product design using both mechanical engineering and electrical engineering tools in the PTC PDS. They were able to define and execute their manufacturing processes and include technical publication, generation and, and publication in that process loop as well. All the while staying in close cooperation with their customer, Megaloaders. So I think you can see how the six product families at PTC really work together as this integral, seamless product development system to allow Engage and you to thrive in the product development wilderness. Thank you very much.